Welcome to the final assessment task of the semester. It is taking place in week 12. It is taking the place of the week 12 lecture and it will take the Monday. The real-time case solution is your final act in services marketing. It combines both theory and practice. The practice being the real-time nature, an early start, kicks off at nine o'clock, finishes at midnight. It is the nature of services that you deal with things that are intangible, that are inseparable, where inconsistency is a factor you have to moderate for, and perishability is an issue you have to address. This is a one-shot event. If you wake up in the morning on week 12 and it's your best day of the year, then that is as much inconsistency as if it's not the best day of the year for you. So you're using the four fundamentals you're going to need to personally engage and deal with those as you solve the real-time case solution. So what will be happening is that you will be given a case study. The case study will have a problem to solve. The thing is, there is no perfect answer to the case study. The problem to solve is how will you, as a services marketing student, recommend answers, solutions to the problem that's you are reading about and being asked to address. Now the thing about a case study is if the case study is based on a point in time, it is a snapshot. It doesn't matter what the company did next. It matters what you advise and how well you build your argument around your advice. So if we take a snapshot from a company who's based in 20, the snapshot's based in 2012, there are six years of what they've done next. That isn't your justification for, oh, well, they did this. What you're being asked to do is to present how you would solve the problem and why your solution is the right solution. To do that, you will need to draw on theory. You'll need to draw on practice, examples and evidence. You have the whole of semester. You have been preparing for this moment by doing the subject. So you'll hit week 12, you'll hit the Monday morning, it will be on, it's 1500 words as a response, it's going to go into the turn it in system, so all the house rules are in effect. To do well on this assessment task, what I am looking for is evidence that you have integrated the ideas of the semester. This is the third and final act, it builds on the skill sets of the first assessment task and the second task. It builds on your capacity to engage the ideas that you've studied, to be able to look back and go, how would I use the seduction model or the service gate model or the marketing mix or the four pillars? How would I use these frameworks? Where do they help not everything from the course will be to will be something you'll want to use, but you have the discretion then to pick and choose the theories, the frameworks, the approaches, the elements that make sense to you. So ultimately, this is your last argument for 30 points. It's your showcase to say, I want these points because I'm going to deliver you an answer to the question posed by this case study. Here's my rationale, here's my justification. It's also been tailored so that it is a one day event. It's 1500 words, it's 30 points. It is designed to challenge you. It's designed to give you a services marketing experience and also to teach you a little bit about yourself and services in terms of its real time high-speed, fast-paced nature.